What is up, peeps? What is up? It's your boy. It's your boy, Shades. Back at it again. Let me know if you can hear me. Or if the game's a bit overpowering, or... Hey, Cedrus. Also, apologies for the rain, if you can hear rain in the background. The rain's a little bit um, crazy at the moment. So, I'm just going to try to work as best I can with what we've got. Um, and we'll just play a few games. We'll play a few games. We'll see how we go tonight. Um, I would like to do a big stream, but I don't know how I feel, because... If I'm going to do a big stream, I might have to do a break in between. So we'll see what happens in that regard. Um, let me just check... If the... Have you tried turning the rain? Thanks, Trills. <laughs> I have. No, I love the rain. The rain's great. Just a bit louder in here. I'm doing okay. Um, bit stressed out today. Not gonna lie, bit bit stressed. Can you guys hear me okay? Can you guys hear me over the game quite well? Options. Let's have a look. Game sounds. Oh, fucking classic. I think this literally only. Chuck and Virgin. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, yeah. Yeah, you can hear me fine. Awesome. And if you can hear the game fine, that's awesome too. Okay, you can't jump on dudes. So... Chuck Rock. Uh, I recently got a Mega Drive version of this. I actually had a... Um, Master System version, and obviously... It's missing a lot to the game. And I wanted to play this one. So, I was like, well... I ended up selling my older version and getting this version. Which I'm pretty happy about, because I think that this version is good. Can I not get up there now? That better not be the case. Chuck Rock's a fucking dick. Have you noticed that? Chuck Rock's a bit of a dick. Like, there we go. There we go. Onga bonga indeed, my friends. Also, let me know if the new background stuff is okay for the stream. Um, Amelia a uh, VA made a really good suggestion that I liked, which was to kind of theme up my my stream in a more retro feel and so one of the retro feels that I wanted to go for was uh, Virtual Boy so I kind of just slapped this together within like five minutes I did it late I did it earlier today I just wanted to see what it looked like um, you know a little glitchiness I mean I don't know how it's gonna go with compressing video but <laughs> we'll have to see about that because I don't know if um, I actually don't know what it's gonna do to uh, to 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 the the compression when I download the video, because part of me was thinking that it might it might crush it because it's quite pixelated in the background. So I'm not entirely too sure what's gonna happen. So we'll see. But if you guys like it and you're a fan of it, I'll keep it. I like it. It's kind of fresh. Like it's a little bit funky. It's literally I looked up. Uh, static on video bullshit like I literally just looked up like what would be the best looking like static in a and I looked up red and black and this is what I got so I was pretty happy with this so how are you doing chat what is up with all of you I've talked enough I need to get up there. I need to get me some of that chimkin. Or that beef. 
Because, you know, in prehistoric times, meat was just lying around. Meat was just doing its thing. Did you fucking see that just then? The fucking skill set I had to have. Oh my god, I didn't see that. This little sleepy bird. Oh yeah, I forgot he had a kick. What does this do? Oh, okay. So I had to unga bunga him to wake him up. Okay. So apparently this game can be beaten in about 30 minutes if you long play it. Which I was kind of like... You know, I'll give it a shot. But I like Chuck Rock. Chuck Rock's just got a good feel to it. Like, it looks cool. The, uh, the Master System version, on the other hand, is, um, it's like the same graphics, but they crush it down, and then, like, they, they do this thing where they get, they remove the background, so it just looks like he's permanently in a night level. Which I guess, like, would save on frames, you know, in the long run, but it's kind of weird. You gotta like time that really well. Or you just make it up there really cool. I was feeling something retro, and while I was away, this came in the mail. So I was like, you know what? Chuck Rock, baby. Let's cross this off the list. I like it. It's just a simple game, simple controls. You know, there's nothing. You know, there's nothing too fancy about it. He's just chucking rocks, you know? Fuck. You know, and there's like a little bit of difficulty with some of the enemies as well. Can I do my old, like, slipperoo? Yeah, get sausage. Yeah, get sausage. Fuck yeah, boy. Because back then it was all about them points, son. Uh, if I've just got to like place this in yes yes chuck rock boy and I was gonna do Abe's Exodus again but I kind of wanted a break I wanted to go back and play something hell chill so this was kind of tonight's sort of like dive back into, you know, just chill gaming, nothing too crazy, you know, collecting sausages and meat, you know, what you do in the cave times. What the fuck is this? Oh, you gotta, do you get on that? What are you doing there? <gasps> oh, it's a seesaw. Nice. Okay, that's pretty fucking rad, son. I like it. Get out of it. Go. On that pig head, though. That pig head is where it's at, though. So it's like, if you have a rock, it like, your jump goes down, obviously, so. So you want to obtain the skill set. To get, fuck yeah, look at that. Prime cut. Fuck, this game is making me hungry. <laughs> this game is actually making me hungry. Holy shit. His stomach is like top tier. That's what they say. Like people say you're fat. No, nah, -uh. not in this town. What you do? Put on all the weight you can because Chuck Rock is proving that having a gut is like the shit. Is the shit? Okay. I'm gonna sneak over. There we go. 
I mean, you could, like, I guess, like, that's a frame skip if you were, you know, rushing it. You didn't need to put a rock down, but... I mean, where's the fun in that? I guess. If I can get this up here. Oh, I see. Does it... Wait, is it... Yeah, okay. I could have just hit that and jumped up too. What a frame skip. You're going to hear a lot of that tonight, I think. It's fucking bird. Holy shit. I think this is a boss. Let me just pull up my my Twitch, uh, Twitch bar on my phone. I forgot to do that. I'm sorry, chat. Like, I can see what you're saying, but, like, I'm also, like, I usually like to have it on my phone. There we go. Yeah, because I had a follower. Cri Christopher, thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. And then I don't know when these happen. Someone sent me, like... Oh, that was like... Oh, okay, that was a while ago. Alright. So, I want to... I guess I want to... Good lord. So you want to, like... Fuck. Okay, so I figured it out. You just gotta stand here. You just all you gotta do, you just gotta... Easy shit. Oh, that's easy. He just gets faster, that's all. He's fucking dead. Found the strat. Found the strat, indeed, White Phoenix. Hey, pro. It's Caveman Crimson Chin. It's, it's pretty much it, yeah. Oh, new world. Satan's anus. <laughs> Welcome to Satan's anus. Look at that spider was drawn by a five-year-old. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. What is that poo monster? Is that a poo monster? Is this all poo? I think, I think this level's all poo. I think that's the gag. It's not just like, we're not just in a cave. It's a poo cave. I hope that's it, because Se Sega had like a way of hiding shit back in the day, like, like you would hide really fucked up humor in something really simple. Thank you. I thought it looked really cool. It's going to be a fairly big stream tonight, I'm hoping, so if you peeps want to join me. Uh, by the way, I want to uh, shout out uh, the fact that we just published a game by a good friend of mine. I know there's a few bugs. Galactic pickup artist. We're working on the bugs as we speak. We're working on a few other things, but it would mean the world to me if you could write a Steam review. Because is that a fucking surfboard? It's because writing a review helps the game jump up the algorithm. The more the more like reviews we get, the better the game ends up being on Steam. So it would mean the world to me if you wrote a review. For the game. Um, it just take five minutes to, you know, just write something. Was it the red lines? What was, 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 is it? What, what English is that? <laughs> was, is it? 
I don't get was. <laughs> I'm gonna stop reading that. I can't understand it. Was is it? He dead, son. Okay, these levels will be getting slightly harder. There's lots of poo everywhere, so. What is it? Oh, so I just googled um, static footage moving. It's it's just a glitchy TV. It's not really meant to be anything. Um, it's just like a little thing to kind of... I'm more concerned about what happens when I download the video if it's going to fuck the interlacing because having something distorted in the side might fuck the footage. So whether or not it stays tonight will be the, you know... But I thought it was kind of cool, it's subtle, like it's not too in your face. Um, you had the you had the English for a second, that's okay. I was worried, I thought you were having a stroke. <laughs> so, it's all good, dude. God, fuck off, these fucking big things, little things, everything wants to fuck me in the anus. I need that. I need that so desperately. That he's throwing poo! The little dude's throwing poo. It's Virtual Boy, isn't it? Uh, it's not Virtual Boy, but I did Google it to find something that was very similar to Virtual Boy. So yeah, my... So like, if you look at my theme now, like, it, I... Let me pause this for a second. Um, if I go to starting soon, that's what it looks like now. Like, it's kind of like a glitchy video game. I thought it was better than having the static. Than to, you know, have something... I don't know. Was that a poo dinosaur? Look, I... I... Look, we're just gonna assume that it's poo. Because... Seager. Okay. Oh, it just takes my rock. Fuck you. That's a, it's definitely a poo dinosaur. This whole level's poo. Look at it, it's just poo. There's poo everywhere. It wants me to take that. It wants me to take it with me. Okay, got it. Got it. Dun, 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 dun. I've also got some more uh, cart games to play. Um, they'll be coming soon, so we'll be do it. We'll be going back to our um, our cart segment. Uh, what was it? Cart cart games, cart game streams. Um, I think we've pretty much done everything on PlayStation One. This <laughs> is Terry Stratch Dome in 2D. It pretty much is, except there's there's a lot more poo. You know what? I didn't actually think about that. I guess a lot of what's in Terry's dome is poo. Like, it's probably just sewage and sludge and poo and everything mixed in. I never really thought of that. Whoa, that means I'm the first lewd game on Steam to have scat. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. I actually really dig this game, though. This game's really cool. Like, it's slow, but it's responsive. You just collect and shit. It's just Chuck Rock. He's clearly got the munchies. And he wants to get food. Terry <laughs> says, ew! <laughs> it's true, though, when you think about it, though. What happened to him? Did he get scared? What happened? Did I just find a clutch? Oh my god, I glitched it out. <laughs> he put that back on you, man. Good sir. <laughs> Shady Lucart. Breaking the terms of service. <laughs> Dude, Chuck Rock is like perfect body figure though. Don't you reckon? Like He's a man's man. <laughs> gotta have gotta have the signature water level. 
can't do it without secret. You stun locked him, pretty much, yeah. <laughs> pretty much. Definitely wasn't my intention. Oh no, I was so close to heart. Turtle dad bod, yeah. Chuck rock, more like Chuck pussy. <laughs> the swimming's weird because you don't actually push a button. You just, uh, you just control the direction. Which is a really weird thing to do. Like, there's no, there's no, like, uh, controlling of speed and, um, it's hard to explain. Chuck is peel, peak male physique. <laughs> Chuck Rock will like Chuck Gollum. Got him. Chuck Rock. Oh, shit. I've missed you, chat. I've missed you, chat. Come here. I want to hit you with my fat. <laughs> okay. So what have you been up to, chat? Like, talk to me. Tell me all your shit that's been happening. Oh, I reckon I could, like... This shit. Oh, thank you for the squish. Chose in with the squish. Oh, look, it's my ex girlfriend. Fuck yeah. She... <laughs> that was close. That was close, boys. Oh my god, I start with no health. Chuck, please. Chuck cock. Penny <laughs> one hand dick in the other. <laughs> Look, I ain't gonna lie. Look, there are many days where I work where I work one handed. And you know what? It, you get it gets the job done. Sometimes you got a multi fat. I mean task. Look at that. A little sneaky little little fat jab behind a rock. No, get on. Get on. <sighs> I posted Gary's mod video yesterday. Drew a Ludus cheater before that. Well, you're gonna have to send me the Ludus cheater picture. Otherwise, I'm gonna be very mad. <laughs> also, we finished your uh, your cart, by the way, pro. I forgot to tell you about that. Because I went away literally the moment like Ducky finished drawing it. But she finished it. So we're now on the phase of getting it into the game. Can I... Are you motherfucking serious? Let me up there, bro! Hard there. Oh my god. That dude was swole. No. The big cum. Oh, boys! Yeah, continue. Yes. Bonga, bonga. Gotta show me that. Yeah, remind me after the stream. I completely forgot, because I... I got some stuff from Ducky, like... As I was traveling on the train to see my mum. Uh, and then, like, I completely... I was like... So, I don't know if I told you, peeps. I, I, I let it known on Twitter, like, two days ago that I, um... I left to go visit my mum in Kalgoorlie, which is about eight hours away from where I live. That's where my mum lives. Um, fuck her. Um, I went to go visit her, um, and I kind of just went away to, to have some time off for myself. I didn't tell anybody because I really wanted to just kind of like... I guess just have my, my own time, I guess. And plus to see my mum after all the shit that's been going down. So, it was really nice to kind of 
get away and, and chill. You know? Um, which I have a few stories as well. Which I'll tell on stream. Um, but it was good to see my mum. Because, again, we don't see each other that often. But now that we've kind of made an, a, an effort... I've made an effort to finally go up and see her after so many years. I've decided that I'm going to to visit her more. Because obviously the last few years with my dad and, and all the drama and stuff with the house, like, I couldn't visit mum. As much as I really wanted to, um, I, I put a lot of... I had to put everything on hold for my career, which was kind of a dick move. But at the same time, like... I finally got to visit mum, and I really missed it, like, I really missed, like, hanging out with my mum at her place. Because when she comes down, it's different, like, I'm still here, and I'm still, like, technically working. But when I'm up there, like, the only thing I did was check emails, and reply to some devs that were, like, for some projects that I was like, okay, we need to sort that out. But that's it. Like, I didn't do any dev work, I didn't do any video editing whatsoever. I pretty much just like zoned myself out to chill for about a week, which in my opinion was probably the best. How am I supposed to hit this little dude? Oh, I just meant to stun lock him. The fuck is that? That is a prostate. I don't know what it is. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing to hit him. Because the, the swimming doesn't help. Fuck. He go unga bunga. He do. Wait, are you kidding? We get no... You only get one continue for Chuck Rock. You only get one continue. Speed run. Speed run, boys. I want to know... Yeah, it's brutal. This game is brutal. That's alright, though. I need to know if... Getting points... I, it feels like an obvious thing. Getting points gives me a life. Just gotta be more careful. It's alright, the great Unga Bunga is back. He's back, boys. First few levels are pretty easy anyway, so if I can stun like that fucking... That dude... I'll be swimming. But yeah, uh, stories, stories. Uh, so, went to Kalgoorlie, visit my mum. Kalgoorlie is kind of like, uh, it's a town, but it's way more desolate than when I am. Like, when a lot of people think of Australia and they think of red sand, like, that's usually where Kalgoorlie is kind of, Kalgoorlie is a mining town, so, you know, a lot of people, you know, they go there to, to work. Um, the... I went up there to visit mum, but also she had a few things where she asked me a couple things where she wanted to start playing video games again. And she was like, oh, I really want recommendations for video games. And so, but it, because it'd been so long, I was like, you know, I can't, so I, what I did was I got her a Nintendo uh, DSi XL. That was my preferred choice of console because there was a lot of games on it. Big screen. Like, it's not Switch, but it's still really good quality because there's a lot of games. And I had to find games that she would like, so I kind of went through this phase of... So, like, we bought the DS, and then I went out and I, I sourced some games, which... DS games are so cheap now. Like, they're ridiculously cheap.
Um, so I found out. So Mum likes obviously. Mum likes Mahjong Sudoku, which I actually like. Mahjong Solitaire. I think Mahjong Solitaire is a really chill game to play. I actually really dig Mahjong Solitaire. Um, but the other games that Mum I didn't realize Mum would like. Uh, Professor Layton. Mum really likes the Professor Layton series. I got her, I think it was Lost Future, and then there was another one. Um, she really liked those, and then she also likes, surprisingly, a games that I guess I used to play in my youth and I don't really play anymore, but object finding games. So, like, I Spice shit. Like, which I was really surprised. This is some really good high quality I Spice shit. Like, I know, like, when we think of I Spice stuff, we think of a lot of shovelware shit, but I was quite surprised that when you look on the DS, there's some good shit. I was I was pleasantly surprised with the quality um, of some of the games that I found, and I was able to oh, fuck. I was able to get her some really cool shit, um, and yeah, I was pretty I was I was pretty happy with the games that we got her. Like, she ended up with way more games than, like, I would have ever had to play as a kid. Um, and I think, you know, she was really happy with that, so. <laughs> I didn't get an eyeball pussy. So, yeah, so that's basically, like, part of my trip was, like, finding mum some cool, like, games to play and, like, what she would be into. Um, alright, so fun fact about this game, there's actually sexual content they took out of Chuck Rock, I'm not even kidding. So, in the, I think it's the Amiga version, there's a cutscene at the start, where Chuck Rock's wife is bending over while doing the washing, and I wish I was kidding, because it sounds like a lie. And it's not a lie. Um, and they took it out of the game because obviously it was a bit sexual. That, and apparently there's a line at the end of the game. Which I guess interprets the fact that Chuck Rock ends up getting some Chuck pussy in the end. And he, like, fucks a bitch. Which, I guess, you know, like, caveman Unga Bunga, he's gonna get that Bunga. Um, there's still sexual I mean, at the start menu, you get to see them all playing the guitar and you see his wife. And, like, his wife's tits are out. So, even old games like this, they were not shy at giving you sexual content. They were definitely not. I think it's going to have to be a point system that I get lives. I think that's what it is. Because the way I'm seeing it is... So he did get Dino Pussy. Oh, fuck, dude. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Or Steve, I would say, yeah, dude. Okay. Fuck. Sometimes this game can be brutal. Fuck. This this game, like. When it throws enemies at you, it's really interesting too, because like enemy design in this game is really cool. Like, they're not just all backwards and forward shit. There's actually some like Like different different spikes in like you hit an enemy and sometimes they turn smaller. There's enemies that hit you with a hammer. There's enemies that like have like a sort of space invaders trajectory. There's enemies that move slow, there's enemies that move fast. There's a lot in this game that I really wasn't expecting in terms of enemy design. I mean, once you learn what the enemies look like, you kind of get an idea of like, okay, that's how it moves. So I've got to like, I've got to move with how it does. Okay, so let's, let's get this cunt out of the way. He's just a dick. This guy's just a dick. just woke up. Weren't you awake just a few seconds ago? I wonder, 
they knew that this boss was easy. But it's okay because we can leave now. Chuck Rock. Welcome back to the poo cabins, boys. God, there's so much poo in here. And look, back in the in the background, there's an asshole. Give him a poo. This game is very, like, strategic in the fact that you should probably take your time to... Like, you can see that, like, there's some times where I rush. Sometimes it's just good not to rush. Bro! That was some prime cut. Literally up shit creek. You're pretty, pretty much. I don't like those guys. Those guys can get fucked. The little poo monsters. Okay. But, I don't know. The game's just got this little creative sort of... Like, this is what the game looks like. It's kind of got its own style. Gritty. There's like a grittiness to it. Give me that mushroom. There we go. Alright, I've almost I've almost got a hundred thousand points. Do you think it'll give me a life? You're fucking better. Can you guys hear the rain? Can you guys hear that shit? Bro. Oh yeah, I got life. A hundred thousand points, you get a life. Holy shit. That is some work. That's some work right there. They want you to collect everything in this game. What system is this on? Uh, it is on the Mega Drive. Or the Genesis. Okay, get up Pooh Mountain. Fuck. Fucking music's a bop too. Holy shit. The music in this game is a pure bop. Can I get this? Come here. And then do this. And then do this. Here, yeah, boy! Strats. Bunga, 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 bunga. Oh, fucking poo slinging, fucking. Again. That's all. That has to be what it is. It has to be poo. I'm rushing it a little bit again. I need the big meats. I need the big prime cutlets because that's where we're getting the massive points from. Go, 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 
go, go, go. I mean, you get points from enemies, which is fine. I mean, that's fine too. Big meat. You do. Game devs be like, it's mud, guys. It's true, though. Oh, so when he roars at you, you... <sighs> there we go. Guys, if you ever get attacked by a saber tooth... Just stun lock him on a cliff. It's so easy to do. Then you'll get big meat. Level 2 clear. Level 3. Level 3, baby. We're back at the fish. The prime cutlets. What's a game you guys want to see me play? I I'm curious, like... In terms of retro games, uh, obviously, <laughs> furious air humping. Yeah, you, look, see if we can buy the rights to Chuck Rock, and I'll rename it Chuck Cock. I could easily make a lewd unga bunga game. Do you reckon anybody's made a lewd lewd caveman game? I feel like we could do that. I need this. Need this to hit the dude. Oh. Oh, that's fine. I eat the fish. I'm almost halfway to another life, so. Take that for what you need. If you look hard enough? What do you mean? What do you mean if I look hard enough? What was that in response to? If this game doesn't count. <laughs> oh, with the K. Oh, lewd caveman games. Yeah, I guess so, when you think about it, yeah. I mean, look, a anybody can fap to anything. I don't think there is a thing where you can't fap to something. There was a really good thread the other day that I think. I don't know if it was Ivy that posted it. Uh, but she. I think it was her. Or it was another VA who admitted they were like, "Do you? Does anyone fap to music?" And I thought I was the only one. There was like a brief period in my life where I would just fap to music. There was just certain music that got me going, man. There's just certain tunes. <laughs> Welcome to Zootopia, where anybody can fap to anything. It's true. Australian man plays Onga Bunga Cave Man game while rainstorm happens outside. That rain is hitting harder than my dirt. Welcome, Blue. <laughs> you actually just walked in to a conversation of me talking about fapping to anything. Holy shit. Alright, we're back at Big Chungus. Okay. 
you can hear the rain. It's fucking heavy, son. Holy fuck! I don't know how much I can dodge there, though. Oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. I'm gonna come! Ah! <laughs> Alright, level three. We now need to work on getting lives. Boys, ladies and gents. Whoa! This fucking dick. Holy shit. What's this saber tooth fuckhead doing? There's a bag of peas up there! Holy shit. Give me that. How do I. Ho! That rain is make. Fuck. I'm so happy with rain. You know why? Because rain gets me fucking happy to stream. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Fucker, man. Holy shit. It's the obligate. Yeah, much like how the last level was the obligatory uh, water level. Alright, I get one continue. Oh, my score goes back to zero because fucking Satan. Give me the Unga Bunga Rock. Okay. Give me the bag of peas! Yes! The mighty Chungus. If you can change your fate, would you? Literally what Chuck Rock said before he died. Try to duck, and they aim. Fucking holy shit! <laughs> Piece of shit. Come on, bite. No, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Ho! Oh, oh, that's sexy. Holy shit, did you see that? I got a semi. Give me them peas. There's health down there, though. I kind of need it. Yes. Yes. Do you hear that rain? Chat. That's some rain. Fucker. Absolute fucking Chad. ASMR. Australian sits in shed while playing video games, raging out at caveman Bunga. This is literally this. This character is actually based off Kung Kumbum VA, the Ungabunga herself, Queen fucking Ungabunga. 
Oh, you can't hit them back either. You fuck. Okay. Do you peeps like ASMR? That's a that's a good question for chat. Uh, do you like ASMR? If so, what's the kind of ASMR that you like? That I'm curious about. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh yeah, give me that suck, boy! I oh, see, I didn't know I could hit the... It's good plastic crinkles are tight. You like you like ASMR? Fuck yeah. Never really tried it more than once or twice. Okay. So I had an idea for the channel of doing ASMR videos. But how it was going to work was I was just gonna get VAs to read video game information. So like the history of like the Sega Mega Drive, or the history of the Super Nintendo. And it would just be like a sexy VA whispering about... Like, whispering a wiki page. Are you fucking kidding me? This fucking... This fucking dude stunlocked me in the corner. This fucking dude's now gonna kill me. Holy shit. I'm gonna lose on this level. Oh my god, I need points. I need points so bad. Daddy needs points. Stop with the snowballs! Bro! I'm fucking serious right now. Thank you. Not really, just one video works. What video? What is there a specific video that you have that you go to? I know for some people like I know for some people there are certain like videos that like they can't get triggers from anyone else like their shit will only work for shit for the people that they listen to. Do you know what I mean? Absolute fucking Absolute Chad. This. F I'm almost dead. I get game over. I got game over all over again. Alright, I'm just gonna like. Yeah, like, if you guys would think that's a good idea, then we'll do it. Like, because my, my biggest thing is, like, like, ASMR shit that chills me. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, I love shit that I can just listen to for hours. And I thought it'd be really cool to have, like, a playlist of chicks reading about... Because one of the chicks that I watch, she did... There's one, there's one drinking video, but that's it. Oh, well, definitely share it with me, dude. I'm interested in, like, people's triggers, because I'm in, really into ASMR a lot. But I thought about, like, how, you know, whether it's whispering or quiet talking, because I know some people are into different shit, so I wouldn't want to kind of, like... It's hard, because I want to find a common middle ground that you would all like. Do you know what I mean? Like, if I was to do ASMR, like, I get somebody to do it, I would want them to do the triggers that you guys would want. This rain can fuck off, though. Holy shit! This rain is an actual mood right now. I'm so close to getting an extra life. 
I fucking... I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. Are you serious? How many levels are in Chuck Rock? I need to know. Is it worth my time? Chuck Rock. Hang on. Chuck Rock. Chuck Rock. Levels. Levels. Not church. What? I'm gonna look. I'm gonna see. Hang on. How to play in level one. Level two. Level three. What did we get up to? Level four. Four, level five. Bro, we were at the second last world. We're going again. Sensual. Sensual as you get. I love it. Yeah, would you guys want to do, like, I was just thinking it'd be like chill and then you could put something on in the background. Because I know some of you guys like the interviews and shit, but I was also thinking about how there's also a really interesting market for, I, I really like uh, video game ASMR to the point where I haven't found anybody else that does it. Like, I've seen a couple of chicks do it, but I'm... It's a hella short game. It fucking is. We got up to second last world. You know what that means, boys. It means we're killing everything that moves. This is the run. This is Death's the run. Uh, it, the game can be finished in like 30 minutes if you like know what you're doing. The, I'm playing it blind. This is my first time like... I played the Master System one and I played the Game Gear one. But I've never ever completed it. Oh, uh, maybe I've completed the Game Gear one. I don't remember. I can't remember if I have. I don't know. We're gonna go for everything. Cause that's we need extra lives is what we need. Oh I see. I see what it wanted me to do. Maybe I can get back up there. We'll see. But yeah, um I've been thinking about those videos for a while now. And how I would approach doing something like that. Obviously, they would cost us money to do them, but I think it would be pretty cool. Oh, did I just fuck myself? Yeah, I did. So, yeah, like little meats add up to big meats in this game. You want to go for big meat. You want big meat. This game is all about big meat. And oh, little sausage. Some prime cutlet. See, make an ASMR tier in Patreon. That could be kind of cool. I gotta think of more tiers actually.
Got it. Chuck Rock's my mood. Chuck Rock is mood. Do I want to go this way? I guess. Oh yeah, I do. I do, because I want that. I wanted that for sure. Is there an extra meat over here? There is a extra meat. I will take it. And a snozzage. So this this run is going to be all about point grabbing. Because that's all we need to do. Is just get points. Get everything. So I'm going to try to collect. As much as I can. And then hopefully... Profit. Because we need them lives. Okay. Okay. He's the big boy. He's the big boy. Step one, meat. You know me. Step two, meat. Yes. So you get what I'm saying? Look at that. It's all about maximizing your meat margins. Imagine this is Wolf of Wall Street, except you're a caveman and you're trying to collect raw, uncooked meat. That's all this is. This is just Wolf of Wall Street, but instead of stocks, it's meat. That's all this is. It's the same principle. Look at that. Beautiful. Yet there's an egg there and we can't eat that. If a sausage factory had a staff meat, is it a meat meat? It is definitely a meat meat. A meat and meat. A meat a meat and greet at the meat. A meat a meaty a meaty meat and greet. If that was for the new staff, it'd be a meaty meat and greet. Fuck yeah. When you're thinking about points, it's harder to get get that maximum. Okay. <laughs> it's all about <laughs> That's a shirt. It's all about maximizing your meat margins. Yep. That's all it is. It's maximizing your meat margins. That's all it is. Just gotta remember that, kids. Any scene of Wolf of Wall Street, just replace it with Chuck Rock. 
Look at that, beautiful. That is so a shirt. <laughs> I mean, you could take that any way you want, really, when you think about it. Maximizing your meat margins, yeah. It's a shirt you would definitely not wear out in public. <laughs> There goes my poo rock. <sighs> like, it's hard to decide which way I want to go in the poo caves. Because there's a lot going on. What's your favorite episodes of Shades? <laughs> it's the favorite episode of Shades, Billy. It's the one where Shade talks about meats for a long time. <laughs> Look, you guys, I don't think you guys understand the severity of the meat situation. Look, there is no shortage of meat in Chuck Rock. Look, there's a carrot. But carrot, 450 points. Uh-uh, not in this house. When you see maximum meat, was that 800 points? Sure. What's that? A giant meat? Is that a giant tomato? 10,000 points. So close. It's all about their meat margins, boys. All right, chat. Question for you: What is your favorite meat? Do you have a favorite meat? <laughs> Tell me your favorite meat. <laughs> What's this stream gone? Oh shit. Oh, I needed to get up there. There could have been secret meat. Don't you love it when like you you go to a cave and you find secret meat? I love that. Like you know in video games they've got like like wall chicken and you find chicken in a wall it's like that but secret meat yours <laughs> good answer spicy chimkin oh my god who doesn't love a bit of spicy chimkin i made i made mexican burgers today i marinate my burgers in this mexican spice so i had like these burgers and old english cheese and I, I marinate it in that and like have this like tomato paste and it's fucking godly. Like, you come over my house, any of you come over my house, I'll make you food. We might even make love. The food usually happens before sex because I like to work it off, but I get hungry after. So never know. <laughs> okay. Chuck Rock Boy. Give me that carrot. I need that secret carrot. So I've got an extra life. Which... I mean, I, I don't know what that means in the world of Chuck Rock. You can't get extra continues, I've noticed. Which is kind of frustrating. But I guess that's, again, Chuck Rock, so... Dude, Chuck Rock is... a pretty good game, not gonna lie. I am digging it. I'm actually digging this game a lot. Ever play Explosion Man? Yeah, isn't it like, and then there's Miss Explosion Man. Uh, I did a dat moment on Miss Explosion Man. I didn't play it. I knew someone that played it. And I'd watch them play it. It was one of those games that I just, I couldn't afford. 
Because back then it was like, you know, games were pretty expensive. Back in my day. Take my be all rock up there. Look at that. You play it carefully, it's not too hard. Gotta get all the fruits and veggies. Final Boss Explosion Man is literally a giant meat golem. Is it really? No, I played... Why did I show Miss Explosion Man? I'm trying to remember, like... There was a sexy moment. I did talk about it. It was, like, one of my first sexy moments in gaming. And, um... I'm trying to remember. Somebody... Somebody had mentioned it. And I said, I probably should, because I've, I've watched someone play it before, but I've never seen... The game's very self-aware that she's sexy. You know, like the game knows that she's a sex symbol. Which is fine. The Bride. That's it. That's it. The Bride. Fuck, it was that long ago. I only just found out there's a sexy moment in the Virtual Boy. I just got a Virtual Boy for my birthday, and I found out that there is a sexy moment in that game. Uh, Peach can wiggle her ass during tennis. And I was like, what? That's going to be the most hidden and convoluted that moment in gaming ever. Like, nobody's going to know that sex sexy moment's going to, like, be existing. Triple kill, fuck yeah. Shades is a sex symbol. I try. I try, believe me. Rome wasn't built in the day. <laughs> Where are the flames coming from? Give me that bird. There we go, he's out. I don't know, but then, like, the weird part is some of the mushrooms are collectibles, and some of them are background objects, and some of them are enemies. And so it's very hard to determine what is an enemy and what is, like, not an enemy. I'm just gonna let this clown walk off. So this, we have now entered into the zone in which I don't want to play this level, but we need maximum points, so I want to get extra lives, thus being that. The rain has stopped. But the love has just begun. So if I sneak around, I might be able to find some light. That enemy is going to be worth a lot of points, I bet you. Oh, he's gone. Oh, there he is. What, what was he worth? I didn't see. Got it. Oh. Okay. 
Thank you. Oh. Oh boy. What a dick. Well, I passed that level, so that's all right. It's a matter of getting to the next I was so close to getting that fucking... That's annoying. I lost the life that I earned. It's alright. We can get it back. That's, that's Chuck Rock, baby! That's all Chuck Rock. That's Chuck Rock, baby. fish. Lots of fish. Lots of fish, baby. Okay. Here comes that rain again, boys. Chuck, chuck and rock and suck and cock. Dude, a gay game. A gay game. Chuck rock three. Sucking rock. People would eat it up. Did it. <sighs> oh, he can almost drown. Fuck, he was almost drowning. I didn't see that. World 4. Is there secret meats down here? That's why I went down here. Some health. Take it. I'll take the peas. I'll take the peas. I'll take the peas. First try. Fuck yeah. See, see, that's all it is. Is like you know, pra practice makes perfect. Fucker. Wow, why didn't that kill him? You notice though that like. The points do add up over time. Okay. The great oogity boogity. Fuck. I knew the moment I walked. Throw your snowball. Dickhead. We're back here. Back here, world four. Some peas. Back at the crime scene. <laughs> it's so true. 
where it all ended badly. It's because I was rushing it, that's why. Alright boys, bag of peas up there. So how you pick like, so, hang on, let me just check what time it is, 11.25, that's not too bad. I'm playing this for what, 10, 11, one and a half hours, I mean that's pretty good for my first blind playthrough of this game. Again, I've never, like, really played this game, so for me, this is, you know, this is a first. And again, once again, I'm, I'm so happy to have you peeps watching. Like, it means the world to me that you peeps get to see me beat games live, or at least attempt to. health so badly holy shit oh I might oh I might have missed out on some prime meat I've never been more excited at prime meat shades needs that sweet meat There is a secret meat up here for sure. Oh my god, there's so many peas! Fuck yes. I'm on my way to another life, boys. Okay, so I need this rock to get back across the great Biongus. This fucking asshole. The snow guys? The snow guys are absolute fucking assholes. I cannot stress how I hate them. Oh my god, another bag of peas. You fucking serious? I've never been so excited for vegetables. Fuck! Rest in peace, Fedora. Your career ended... Much like your sex life. It kind of just sort of was like, ah! <laughs> Dude, do peas duplicate? The peas duplicate, don't they? I bet you they duplicate. Yes. Yes! What a score. What a score! Oh my god, that was so close! They blend the spikes in really well up the top. Fuck! I died at the same spot. Fuck. Stop. 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 
Okay. Look. The peas are the only saving grace. Because it's not like I'm mining it, but... I hit you. Um, I can kind of farm lives, like, in a long period of things. Go the other way, dickhead. There's another bag of peas. Can you use the rock to block the spikes? Probably. I'm gonna get that health. I'm just going to take my time. Just going to do one hit at a time. Just going to take my time. Come on, big boy. Got him. Well, five. Let's go. That's me. Why is that bone got a face on it? This mon this this is me. This guy here, the green dude, the chonkus.
everything is dead. It must be like end of the world. Like, apocalypse. Is that the Grinch on that? That looks like the Grinch, dude. On that rock. Yeah, I think it's the apocalypse. The big old media hit. It looked like Grinch, right? This game's so lewd, we're literally in Bone City. I don't know about you, but I got a semi. Like... I have a semi. Chuck Rock is giving me a Chuck Rock. <laughs> Dude, those bones are worth 10,000. Town. Oh, that review. It's not a oh, it's not a bone. I want a bone. I want it. I want it. Oh, <laughs> Chub Rock. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I missed one. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, wait. No, I could get it with this. There we go. Fuck yeah. Man, they're handing out those bones, man. I... Oh, okay. Oh, okay! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! And this vor. There's Vore, baby! We're gonna fight a giant poo in the end, I bet you. Give me that bone. It is a fucking bore. Got him. Hang on. Hang on! Fucking... All right, I found it. I found the. I found the trip. I found it. I got it. 
Yes! I did it! Woohoo! Oh, hell yeah, but Chuck fucking rock. Chuck fucking rock, boys. Well deserved vacation. Look at that. Perseverance. Credits. Hell yeah. Fucking Gary. It's always Gary. It's always Gary. <sighs> that was a good game. I actually enjoyed that game. It was pretty good. Like, that legitimately was a fun game. I, um, I really dug that. Chris Long? Fucking hell. Bob out in it. Cool. What happens now? You just can't exit the game. Peeps, do you want me to hang around for another game? I think we got time for another game. Would you peeps like another game? was hectic more game fuck yeah all right give me five minutes i'm gonna go make myself a drink and i'll be right back we'll go to a be right back but i'll still be here just uh making myself a drink so hang around and i will be right back with some more more games more games hang tight hang tight peeps i'll be right back